CPR, or cardiopulmonary resuscitation, is a crucial emergency procedure performed to manually keep a person's blood circulation and oxygenation going when their heart and breathing have stopped. Here's a breakdown of what happens in the body during CPR. CPR aims to maintain blood circulation to vital organs, especially the brain and heart, by manually compressing the chest. When the heart stops beating effectively, cardiac arrest, blood flow to the body's tissues and organs ceases, depriving them of oxygen and nutrients. Chest compressions in CPR help maintain some blood flow, albeit not as efficient as the heart's pumping action, but enough to sustain vital functions temporarily. CPR buys time by artificially circulating blood and oxygen until the underlying cause of cardiac arrest can be addressed or more advanced medical interventions, such as defibrillation or medications, can be administered by trained healthcare professionals. CPR increases the chances of survival and reduces the risk of permanent brain damage in those who experience cardiac arrest.